after um, spending maybe the last eight or nine months in the hospital with just to be supportive of you know what I was going through with my father, I had to wake up and learn how to cope with the stress that was really overwhelming. So I called my trainer, Craig Ramsey, he's amazing. He took me to the grocery store and said, you can eat this and you can't eat that. And we're gonna walk it off and we climb to the top of all the mountains in LA and you know, you just start to feel really good because your body releases um, the hormones that create a natural healthy high and it obviously uh, gets rid of all the stress and you get the endorphin rush and then that becomes a very addictive feeling. So I've just been, you know, also journaling my food. It, it really is a lot. It, it's a big effort to lose weight when you also have to make all the other modifications like spending time at the gym, spending time making proper food choices and making all of these changes and being consistent with it. I mean, it is really all encompassing. And then, you know, you sort of decide that it feels so great that it's going to be a permanent change. It's not just like a, oh, as soon as I reach this number, I'm going to stop. No, you just want to keep it going. And you, and I also want to get healthy, not just for the wedding, but also to be able to God willing, you know, try to get pregnant and chase some babies around a park. Okay, let's talk about those babies that are coming. You've expressed that you really want one. What is that process like? Are you practicing? Is there one on the way? What's going on? Um, marriage first. Okay. We put that on hold because of all the other stuff that was going on. So marriage, family as soon as possible.